definitely some deer going down here. I see a lot of deer tracks. That running water, these creeks, I love these spots like this. Absolutely love them. So that right there is all around my camp. <laughs> yes, sir. I've got wood for days, for days. Woo, woo. So that big boulder was already there. I just went and grabbed some rocks, put it around it. I'm gonna build me a fire right there. This is my war bonnet hammock. Not really sure which brand to which style it is. It's so old. I've had it for a long, long time. It's the one that has like a pocket shelf. Going down to get some water. Trying to get a signal on the inReach. <laughs> I get a better uh, call to the little lady. Let her know where I'm at and I'm safe. Tell you what, this is a beautiful area, beautiful spot. Oh my goodness, I'm very happy, happy boy to be out here tonight. And behind me, I got camp. As you see, I got fire going back there in the back, but my goodness, I love this view right here. So if you have these chairs, a lot of times just grab a log. I mean, you're in the woods, so you're gonna see a log a lot of times. Just grab one, stick it in the middle, keep it from sinking. This time of year, ground's maybe sometimes a little mushy or so forth, or you might be in a little snow or whatever, but that log works every time. Perfect. So what I brought tonight, I brought a uh, pretzel. And a little cheese, nacho cheese. I'll put that in the skillet, warm it up, pour that cheese over it, eat it up. Then I'll clean my skillet. And then I just brought a Jack Daniels pulled pork. It's seasoned and fully cooked. Made with Jack Daniels Tennessee whiskey barbecue sauce. So this is about as simple as it gets. All I do is open up the bag, put it in the skillet, warm it up. I mean, you can eat it cold. So it, this is about as easy as it gets. And I brought... Some hamburger buns that I'm going to toast up and eat with it. And some crackers that I'm not sure if they're called nip cheese or cheese nips. But anyway, these are the bacon and cheddar flavored. So that's my dinner for tonight. Yeah, call me a pig. That's a whole lot of bread. <laughs> Meat. But it's going to be good. I think it's going to be really good. Chow time for me. Back on pulled pork tonight. Yeah. Yeah, this pulled pork's gonna fry up nice. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Delicious. Kind of cooking it all up together. A little toasted buns. A little pulled pork. Uh uh uh. It's gonna be good. See the moon? It's bright. It just now got over the tree line and I can finally see it. That is absolutely beautiful. Morning. 
fucking time. Oh, I slept good. I could sleep in that hammock for a lot longer. Oh, I was stretched out, comfortable. Left my tarp up. Got to see the moon, the stars all night. Very beautiful. Now I'll make me some coffee. Get ready for, I love the morning time hikes. So peaceful and so quiet. There's not another soul out here. There wasn't another car in the parking lot where I stayed. Clifty Wilderness, very peaceful. Backpack I brought on this one, Hilltop Packs Raven UL40. I've got little straps where I can put my sit pad. I put it on the backrest on there, and it's pretty good. So you can have your sit pad, and it goes on your backpack all in one. If you get a chance, check out Hilltop Packs, the Raven UL40. Always make sure you put the fires out. Always. I threw rocks in there, doused it, threw rocks, doused it again. Always make sure to put your hands down there. Feel no heat, no heat, no heat. It's good to go. Now comes some of the fun part. Where's the trail? <laughs> I know it's up that way, up the hill some. It's time to start trucking off trail up the hill, slipping and sliding and maybe in a little crawling to get up to the top, but let's get up there and find that trail. Back on the trail. It's always amazing how much quieter it is after leaving the water area. Hey, you hear that water all night long. Solo backpacking, it's good for the mind, the body, and soul. Always remember that. If you don't go solo backpacking, try it out. As Jeremy from Midwest Backpacker would say, name that scat. Just about out of here. I wanted to stay at a creek with a beautiful spot. Check that one. Want to have some good food with a campfire. Check that one. Wanted just some peace and quiet with nature and just in a spot where I pretty much knew nobody was going to be in the Clifty Wilderness. Check that. It's a beautiful day, and I'm going to get out of here. And always remember, guys, you got one life. Live it.